How's it going everyone? Travis95HD and today I'm bringing you a squad builder with newly transferred players from the BPL. A little bit of a hybrid in mixed into it. In goal, we got Sean Johnson, the US under 23 goalkeeper. A little bit of a fail with getting into the Olympics, but he's bounced back quite nicely. He's a bronze rare 64, 6 foot 3. His handling does let him down, but that's the only thing. He's he's a good he's a good bronze goalkeeper at left back we got Castillo from the Tijuana Premier Primera Division Mex the Mexican the best <laughs> the top Mexican league 84 pace 71 dribbling he's not very defensive and he's he is pretty weak but he links with Moreno at CDM now at center back we got Frederick Frederick I don't He's a German center back, newly transferred to the Chicago Fire. 71 pace, 77 defending, and 80 heading. He is the best center back in the MLS besides Rafa Marquez, but he's got a lot more pace than Rafa Marquez, so I would recommend him over that. Cuesta, the other Chicago Fire center back we've got in the team. 74 pace, 70 defending, 67 heading. 67 heading. He is a great, great bronze center back. He's uh, six foot three as well. He's quick. He can make up for pretty much getting blown by by someone because he has the pace to catch up. That's all you really need to say about him. He's a, he's a quality quality center back. At right back we got Hall. Plays for FC Dallas. 81 pace, 64 dribbling, 66 defending, and 63 heading. I think he's strong on the ball. He's five foot eleven. He's not too short. Gets up and down the the wing. Defends like he should, and he's just a quality right back. CDM got Char from the Portland Timbers. Set at a CM normally as his default. I converted him to a CDM. Not that expensive. Non-rare, but he's got he's got good overall stats. He's a good CDM because he sits back. He does like to get in and attack every once in a while, but mainly he's defensive-minded. I would I would think he's defensive-minded the way, the way he plays in this formation. Other CDM Moreno five-star skills. The Colombian from the top Mexican flight. 76 pace, 73 shooting, 74 dribbling, 60 heading. He's normally set at a center forward. I didn't convert him to a CDM, but he cost around 4,400 coins, which is quite a bit of a bargain if you ask me. I got him at CDM because I just wanted to have some, some five-star skills in the squad. And to be honest, he doesn't play bad at a CDM. He does tend to sit back. I think he has a medium medium work rate, so he doesn't get out of his position too much. Now moving over to CAM, we got Jack Wilshire, plays for Arsenal. Four star skills. He has a high high work rate, which I don't really like because he's obvi obviously caught defending too much for my liking, at least. And that's about all for him. Let's go over to Marco Marin, the new Chelsea transferred. At Vertebramen, he was set at a left mid. Now he's set at a CAM. Four-star skills, right-footed, 82 pace, 70 shooting, 73 passing, 87 dribbling. His pace, he's got really good acceleration, but not top-end sprint speed. He doesn't have the, that extra gear to get past defenders. He's got the acceleration, which is nice with the skills. And, and when you're in closed and confined areas in the box, so to say. But he's not... The strongest on the ball. He's got a good finesse shot. Not much power behind the shot. But he links with Lukaku. Sam 5000 did. Or had a high review of him. And so do I. He's a good player. He's got great, great left footed power shot. Three star skills. Powerful, powerful on the ball. I seen him play last night for Chelsea versus the MLS All-Stars. And before against Seattle Sounders. And from what, from in real life, I, I think he's a great footballer. He's really strong. He looks so strong on the ball. He is really young, so he's got a bright future ahead of him. Now we have the other transferred. I believe he's just back on loan. Carlos Vela, upgraded version. He's normally a silver, but he had an inform, and then when he went back to Arsenal or got back to Arsenal, he got this upgraded 88 pace, 82 shooting, 76 dribbling, 70 heading, 70 passing card. Four-star skills, left-footed. And in my opinion, he's got a great, great finesse shot. Whip him in anywhere from in the box, he'll score. I mean, that's pretty much all you got to say about him. He's great, great with his left foot. So you got a power up here with Lukaku and then the finesse 
with Vela. We got quite a bit of left footers. Marco Marin right and Moreno right for the attack pretty much. But other than that, let's move over to the goals. Alright, so I didn't get too many goals. I didn't play too many games with this team. But we got a couple nice ones coming up at the end. A couple of corners. That's Lukaku. I love his physical presence on the field. In the game, he's got an amazing, amazing dominance about his play. He's so strong. It's it's unbelievable. And I'm, I'm sure you might have heard this from other reviews and whatnot. But he's just got a physical presence. Here's Marco Marin. He's got a, a decent shot. You see him banging one off the post. But Carlos Vela, that's what I'm talking about. Anywhere inside the box, you get him room on his left foot he's gonna put it in I mean he's not gonna miss he's a deadly clinical finisher and there's Cuesta he's got a nice physical presence that bronze center back too he's coming up against other goal defenders too with this team I was playing four four and a half star teams so he's got he's got a good presence there's Moreno hitting a long shot off the bar Carlos Vela being a poacher which I didn't I didn't notice him being a poacher he's just a deadly deadly finisher Marco Marin, he gets in on the attack every once in a while. He's got four-star skills, as I said. He's got nice ball control. Not the paciest, as you can see right there. He's just sitting back, doing some skills and showing them the dirty. Here we've got some nice passing sequence. I thought this was an amazing goal from Lukaku. That's what I'm talking about with this power shot. Right by the keeper, near post even. Amazing finish from him. I really liked him. He's cheap as well. He's non-rare cheap. I mean, you can't go wrong with, with his purchase, and he's... You, you just can't go wrong. It's Carlos Vela showing off the four-star skills. Ronaldo chopping banger. Well, that's it for me, Travis95HD. A like is always appreciated, and I will see you next time.